The National Standards Project is the most comprehensive analysis of the autism treatment literature that's ever been completed. This is important because parents and educators, service providers and physicians all deserve to know exactly how much research supports the treatments they might use or recommend. The treatments that we included targeted both the core symptoms of autism, but also the many other challenges that individuals on the spectrum might face. Along with the dramatic increase in the number of diagnosed cases of autism spectrum disorders, we've seen an explosion in the number of approaches that are being promoted as treatments for autism. It's very important that the field continues to identify new treatments for autism, but it's equally important that these new approaches be submitted to rigorous experimental investigation. Without research, we simply don't know. Is the treatment effective? Does it not work at all? Or worse, could it be harmful? Parents, educators, service providers, and physicians can all feel overwhelmed at the prospect of selecting from the many different treatment options that are now available for autism. This process can be particularly challenging because people often don't know exactly how much research support is available for each of these treatment options. By convening 45 of the top autism experts from around the country, we've now been able to complete our National Standards Project. As a result, these decision makers will now be armed with critical information that will assist them in their decision making. Our report will be helpful to families in three ways. First, many families want to know what are the interventions that have the most research support. We've identified 11 of these established treatments. Second, families want to know of the treatments that I'm using right now, exactly how much research support is there for the intervention I'm using. Third, our report emphasizes the importance of families in the treatment selection process. The values and preferences of families, including the child or adult with autism, is really essential in the treatment selection process. Professionals play a really vital role in the treatment selection process. Our results will help educators, service providers, and physicians recommend interventions that are known to be effective. But we also recognize that their professional judgment and the data they collect are extremely important in helping them identify which treatments are most appropriate for individuals with autism spectrum disorders. Their expertise is important not only in the initial selection of treatments, but also to help them make decisions about modifying or continuing treatments. In addition to our research findings, our report emphasizes evidence-based practice. Evidence-based practice involves combining research findings with other essential factors. For example, professional judgment and database clinical decision making, the values and preferences of families, and finally, the capacity to accurately implement interventions are all essential. At the National Autism Center, we believe all individuals on the autism spectrum deserve to have access to treatments that are effective and help them reach their potential. Evidence-based practice will help them along that journey. We are pleased to have received overwhelmingly positive responses from parents, educators, service providers, and autism experts from all over the country, but we encourage continued feedback. With additional input, we believe the next version of the National Standards Project will be even more helpful to the autism community.